Here's Johnny! It's been a month since my last few videos. I really didn't have anything much to do for one. Or it's just this time of year. I hate winter. And I'm not into the holiday hoopla. But since Star Wars was coming out, I went to see it. First of all, I watched most of the videos against it. Oh Solo sucks. This will suck. Damn Disney ruined Star Wars. And all that bullshit. I actually liked Solo. It wasn't that bad. Granted should it been made? I don't know. Did it add anything to the other movies? No. It just was a fun little story I thought. Before I go on about Solo wasn't that bad. This isn't about that underrated movie. Okay, like always, I watched few movies before this. I was going through all of them, but it got later and later. So I just watched The Force Awakens, then Last Jedi, and I did it the lazy streaming way. One on Disney+, Plus, then other on Netflix, other than using my own copies. Weird thing, I heard somewhere was paying people to watch all of them on Disney+. Plus. Okay, where was I? Hmm. I can do it without streaming any. Hmm. And not all of them are on Disney yet. So how could that work? But shit, paying people to watch a string of movies. Here I am. Hmm. I do that often. Pay my ass. Hmm. Okay, I watch Force Awakens. Each time I see it, I see a copy of the first one. Okay, I mean episode 4. Okay, next was Last Jedi. Well, even if it wasn't great, I don't know where I'm going with this. That was a little messy. It was a movie. Killing off people that they shouldn't have. I'm not that thrilled with it much. Now for Rise of Skywalker. As I said, I watched videos against it. Being who I am, I'm not a popular opinion type guy. With that said, although I thought more messier than Last Jedi, I did like it. Well, things with it were weird. How the hell did Palpatine survive being thrown down a giant hole and being blown up in the second Death Star? Though Darth Maul in Phantom Menace survived being cut in half and also falling in a hole, but he showed in two animated series then Solo. The Rise of Skywalker was all over the place. I liked how they placed Lando. I liked how they sent off Leia. I knew Rey was related to the Emperor. I don't know why did they call Rise of Skywalker. Every Skywalker and Solo died. Although Rey adopted the name, she's still a Palpatine. They are few unanswered questions. Will Poe get together with that chick in the helmet? Is Finn Force sensitive? Will C-3PO get his memory back? Will we ever know? Another thing, where does Baby Yoda fit in all this? Anyway I did like the movie but it was weird. Anyway I got to edit this. See ya.